right, so I guess this goes back to January. Yep. What year was it? Two years, or two years ago. Yes, 2017. I had a little fluffy golden retriever named Georgia. Uh, I had she, a fluffy little puppy, actually. Yes. Um, golden Doodle named Harper, yes. and it was the night before my birthday. Uh, and we were at this park in, uh, was it Brookhaven? Um, I saw Sharon from across the park, and I was actually with my sister, and I was like, all right, Georgia, come, come over here. We're gonna go to the other side of the park and, and see if you can mingle with her, uh, this pretty girl's dog. And they started playing with each other, and Sharon and I just started talking. I just remember when he reached out to shake my hand, he said, I'm Aaron. I remember thinking it was gonna be a silly response because my name is Sharon. And it <laughs> rhymes, and I was like, oh God, he's gonna think I'm making this up. <laughs> And I just said, hey, you know, the, the dogs are kind of cute. They're about the same age, same size, energy I level. Distinctly, he said, she's so fluffy. Yeah, she's so fluffy. <laughs> and I was like, you know, maybe they, we should organize some dates and maybe we can go with some drinks ourselves. So um, our dogs are a big part of our lives. They're our fur babies. We're like any other millennial nowadays. We love our babies. And uh, it, it definitely was great. That's kind of how we met. And the very next day when I was out for birthday drinks with all my friends, he texted me. He remembered it was my birthday and said, happy birthday. And Made sure to follow up on that dream. I ordered her an Uber yeah. for our first date and the Uber driver got out. It's like, can I get a picture with him? So and she's like, why do you want a picture with him? And I was like, oh. Finally must have had the courage to ask. Yes. We sat down after a glass of wine and yeah. I was like, are you, are you famous? And I was like, no, I just used to get my butt beat in uh, this Sanford Stadium. No, Athens you, you were even better. You said, no, but my brother is. Yes. And I just thought that was the most humble great answer he could have given and I went to Georgia so oh. like I recognized Aaron Murray but I didn't I didn't know what he looked like I wasn't a, I liked going to the games but I wasn't like an avid ball fan by she has no idea what football is uh, and um, so kind of broke it down for her and slowly been teaching her the game of football yeah. she teaches learning. me There's she like teaches learning. me music and how to use big words when I'm on air for CBS and then I teach her football so yeah, it works out perfectly good yes whatever that means <laughs> you look beautiful, by the way. <laughs> um, I've learned over pretty fast couple weeks, month, and over these last couple of years that you are just an absolutely extraordinary woman. Uh, you do so much for me. You're, like I said, you're beautiful. You're smart. You're one of the smartest people I know. You push me. Um, you put up with me. You, you, you challenge me. You support me through whatever I'm doing in life, whether it's whatever job I decide to do that week, you're 100% you're behind me. And it is absolutely incredible. Uh, the love that you have for me, the support you have for me, uh, the way that you treat our little fur babies, just it, it, it just shows me that you not only are you going to be an incredible wife, uh, you're going to be an incredible mother. And, and just seeing the way you act, it just, it just makes me so excited. You are my best friend. You are my best friend. I'm so excited to spend the rest of my life with you. And I vow to cherish you, to love you, to take care of you, to protect you, to be our little peapod, <laughs> to grow all together, to have some babies. And I, just, I love you. Aaron, you are my best friend, and I'm your biggest fan. I'm a fan of your kind heart and your thoughtfulness and your consideration and dedication to every endeavor that you undertake. I promise to laugh with you, to cry with you like we're doing right now, and to grow with you. I promise to always support your dreams and to respect our differences. And most importantly, I promise to love you through all the days and nights of our lives. You're the best dog dad that Harper and Georgia could ever ask for. And I'm so excited to build our lives together and continue living a life learning, full of laughter and full of love with you. Aaron, you may kiss your brother.
first option, Mr. and Mrs. Aaron Murray. 